In a Chinese family culture is that we work very hard, we make a lot of money, and everything is about money. Before Islam, I believe in doing, helping others, and doing good deeds. I don't have any per perceptions about God. Only for Taoism, I know that we worship ancestor like always. You know, ask him for protection. We don't really have a purpose in our life. We just know, okay, we do good deeds, we die properly, that's all. <laughs> so my turning point to Islam is basically due to the robbery that I was being, you know, chopped everywhere, attacked, and I was bleeding severely. Only thing in my mind is that I'm seeking the death because I think if I survive, I become a handicapped person and the doctor even asked me how do you survive I said I'm very lucky that I live and it, it touched me. then from that moment I see different perspective of my life so I, I was given a second chance to to seek for the truth actually. So, Alhamdulillah, I did my Shahada. So I'm glad to be a Muslim now, a practicing Muslim. It is very interesting in the sense that, in the sense that I found myself having to work as well. At the same time, I found myself to have more times to go for classes, to seek knowledge, particularly in al Qadim, and many of the classes are conducted in English where many of the international brothers and sisters can understand the language and besides the class there are many reversions ceremony also the not yet Muslim can always come to al Qadim to understand more about the religion over here you may see it's just like a Sunday class, but it's actually, you see yourself as a, a very big family. They are so warm about each other. Yeah, you, you have to experience it. I, I can't tell you how warm they are in al -Kadir. So my advice to my not yet uh, Muslim brother and sister out there, life is not just about having big car, having a lot of money, you know, having a big, beautiful home is actually more than, more than this. The life is a test. So think about it. Think deeply about it. Seek the truth. You don't just follow other people. Ask your heart where you want to head to. So I, I invite all of you out there to seek the truth, learn about Islam, and inshallah one day, you will do your shahada and become a Muslim like me as well. Thank you. Uh, there was this one day that changed my life, actually. Um, I went with a group of tourists into the bazaar area. And there was a man, it was Friday, and a man closed his shop just in front of us. And he said that he's going now to the Friday prayer. And... Uh, I was telling him that I have a group of people with me who wants to spend all their money because they're traveling tomorrow and how stupid he would be now to close his shop and not to take this money and just, I know that his prices are too high and he will make a hell of money. <laughs> so how come you just close your shop now? He told me, no, I'm a Muslim, it's my duty to pray on Friday. And it made me really think, because when it comes to money, we are all weak. And when it comes to uh, important things in life, I think we all have our family, the first important, and then almost after that, it's money. So I know that this man is living from that, and 
how come he prefers to pray, and I called it kissing his carpet, than taking our money. And that I was thinking a lot about that. Now you, now you become a Muslim. How has Islam changed your life? Oh, it changed me. It changed my life in many parts. In terms of uh, not drinking anymore, not using drugs, not smoking cigarettes, all of these kind of bad things. You know, going to the club and uh, don't listen to music, don't watching movies. You know, just reading, studying, and everything. You know, try to exercise. You know, everything. Before, you know, before, as I said before, in Islam, I was probably waiting 54 kilos, and now, you know. Alhamdulillah, you know, I weighed 70 kilos, thanks to Islam, you know, I gained a lot of kilos because before, as I said, you know, with the drugs and everything, it was not good. And, uh, you know, I gained a lot of kilos, you know, Islam encouraged me to train, you know, take care of my body and everything, you know, before I smoked a lot, you know. And the Salat, you know, SubhanAllah, you can't be more happier to thank Allah every day. He's giving you life, you know, He's giving my life back every time. And I've done all this bad stuff. I can't be more happier than Allah, you know, every time I wake up, you know, for Fajr, Allah give me my life back. He's saying, you have a better life, you, you have a chance to make a better life of you this time. So, alhamdulillah, you know, Islam has changed my life in many parts. When it comes to my parents, alhamdulillah, you know, I obey, I obey them much more, you know, my sisters, you know, I have better manners, akhlaq, whatever, you know, it's all of these kind of things, you know, Muslims should have, you know. So, alhamdulillah, everything is, is much better, alhamdulillah.